If you are having crashes and freezing in Fortnite brand new chapter 5 season 2 on your NEP fee, so in this video I'm gonna show you step by step guide that will help you to completely fix all the crashes in Fortnite. So guys welcome to my channel, if it's your first time here please subscribe and make sure to watch this complete video and with wasting any time let's dive straight into it. So guys before doing any optimization on our windows we are going to refresh or clean all the shatter and temporary file from our PC. So for that go for your window search, search for cleanup and you will find out here your disk cleanup settings on your windows now select here your c drive or the drive where you have installed your fortnite or windows now click on the ok button here you will find out this is kind of the interface now you need to guys simply uncheck the first file now check mark on temporary internet file after that check mark on windows error reporting and feedback directed shadow crashy after that go for delete optimization and here is another important that is your temporary file check mark on these files now click on this ok button and delete all these junk files from your pc this will refresh your all the files with the brand new files on your windows so once you refresh your windows file on the next step you need to download this fixed fortnite all crashes pack on your pc link available down in the description you can download it from official website once you download this file on your pc inside this pack you will find out direct dilemma setup replace these files and visual see one time that is one of the most reason most people are getting crashes and freezing in fortnite now you need to drag this folder on your desktop and now you're gonna utilize these files one by one on your pc so guys in the very first step you need to go for replace these file folder inside you will find out battle i folder DirectX 12 folder and EV anti cheat folder. You need to copy all this folder from here. Right click here. Now go for show more option and copy all this folder from here. Now you need to guys simply go for your drive where you install your Fortnite. So go for this PC, go for local like C, program file, Epic Games, Fortnite, Fortnite game, bind Reven 64, and here you will find out your Battle I, your D3D 12, and EV anti cheat folder. Now simply right click here. Go for show more option click on the paste button and replace the file destination or replace the file and guys that's it now you need to close out this directory now the next step you need to go for next folder that is directx 11 setup and we are gonna install the fresh file of directx 11 on our pc so open up this folder now you need to scroll all the way down and there you will find out this directx setup.exe file now simply double tap here hit yes and open up this directx setup file now click I accept the agreements, now click next, next and this will take few time for installing the DirectX 11 on your windows. Now click on the download and install this feature if the netframe 3.5 is not available click on the download and install and also download this netframe on your PC. So guys once you download this netframe 3.5 version on your PC click on the close button and after that click finish and guys that's it. Now close out your direct Islamic directory setup. Now go for the next file that is visual C one time all in one. So open up this folder inside you will find that multiple version of the visual C one time. Now you need to go for install all the bad file and this will install all the files in just single click. So guys simply right click here go for run as administrator hit yes and guys that's it now just wait and this will guys start installing all these files one by one on your pc and if any of them is missing that will automatically fix that and that will ultimately fix your crashes and freezing in fortnite so guys once you're done now simply close out this directory so guys now the next step you need to open up epic launchers on your pc simply go for your logo or the icon of your epic games now open up your epic game settings now you need to scroll down and find out the settings so simply go for your fortnite now scroll down and check mark on additional command line arguments and guys simply type here minus land play minus no splash minus no texture streaming minus use all available code i will also provide you this command in the description of my video simply copy it from there and paste it here in this command line arguments so once you paste here this command now you need to go back go for library and find out here your fortnite click on the three dots now you need to go for option and there you need to follow the same exact settings now if you are not playing the save the world on your PC in Fortnite, so guys simply uncheck this box, uncheck high resolution textures and also uncheck DirectX 12 shader if you are not playing on DirectX 12. But if you are using DirectX 12 on AMD GPU, so I suggest you and also recommend you to guys simply check mark here and then you will be able to play on DirectX 12. So guys now simply scroll down, there you will find out pre-download steamed acid. Make sure to check mark on this box because this will also reduce the processing of your CPU and your internet. Now here is your additional uh, languages, this is your personal preference, after that click 
click on the apply button and save these changes now the next step again go for three doors now this time go for manage option and click on the verify button and this will guys start verifying your fortnite file if any of the file is missing that will automatically fix that and that will ultimately fix the freezing and crashing in fortnite on your pc or laptop so guys now the next step we are going to optimize our windows power plan settings because sometimes that is also one of the reason behind the crashing of your fortnite so guys for that go for your windows search search for power and open up choose a power plan guys also make sure to use the high performance power plan on your pc but if you have the bitsum high performance i have already made a dedicated video how you can get the bitsum high performance simply guys use the bitsum high performance because this is one of the best power plan on windows for gaming so guys once you apply this power plan on your windows now simply close out now the final and the last step we are going to clean our fortnite crashes data so for that guys you need to open up your file explorer go for the search bar and simply type here percentage local app data percentage and press enter now you need to find out here your fortnite game folder go for it go for save and there you will find out this kind of log folder go for it now select all this file from here and hit delete and delete all this file available in this folder now you need to go back go for lms select this file and hit delete now go back go for demos if any folder is available here simply delete that file now you need to go for next that is your configurations now here is our crash report client go for it select this file hit delete and delete the report of your crashes now in the next step go for windows client and i also suggest you to guys delete your fortnite gamersettings.ini file or use the brand new or latest file in fortnite so guys once you're done now simply close out your file explorer and now you need to one time reach your pc there for all the changes take effect after that launch your fortnite and enjoy the fortnite without having any kind of crashing and guys by the way at the end of this video it is the last tip for you if you are still getting the crashes in fortnite i suggest you to reinstall the fortnite or still if you are having the crashes so guys i suggest you simply install the fresh or clean version of windows again on your pc and that will 100 fix your crashing in fortnite or any other game i hope you love this video please make sure to drop a like on this video and share your opinion about this video in the comment section and see you again in the next video